guys, it's Katie and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a quick video that I wasn't planning on making, but um, if you watch the video that's going up right before this one, you will see that it is a get ready with me for just a day, a casual shopping day, and uh, I did some shopping. So I have a little um, makeup and clothing haul. It's not a ton of stuff. Anyway, I had a little bit of a treat yourself day and so I wanted to show you what I got. First, I went to Forever 21 and I've been really into buying like basics recently because I don't have a ton and um, I just kind of wanted to get some more. So the first thing I got is just this plain v-neck it's a nice kind of um, lighter reddish pink color. I normally buy black and gray of pretty much everything, so I forced myself to get one color, but I think that this will look nice with the colors that I do wear, and it's just like a nice, simple t-shirt. The other thing I got from Forever 21 is this shirt that I actually got. I think I paid like under $3 for this because it was on clearance and then another half off of clearance and it's grayish black and it is just one of those like longer shirts and I like the sleeves on it because it kind of has like you know what I'm saying the where the sleeves up here are a little bit not droopy I don't know what I'm trying to say but they're a little bit baggier so I really like this one and I mean for that cheap you cannot beat it Next, I went to H&M and I picked up a few more things. By a few more, I mean one more. Literally one more thing of clothes. And this, I've been wanting just a casual t-shirt dress for so long now. And I feel like I've almost bought this dress about like 34 times. So I was finally just like, why have I not bought this yet? I look at it every time I go. It's just one of their basics. It's like the Divided brand. Um... I got an extra small because I'm kind of short, so I picked this up. It's just this really nice maroon color. I guess I got two colors today, and um, I just really like it. It was super comfortable, super casual. I kind of want to get like knee socks or something. Not knee socks. I want like the ones that go like up to your thighs, but I went to Catholic school for like nine years of my life, and so that kind of ruined knee socks for me, but now I kind of want some to wear with this, but... I'll probably just wear it with tights, honestly. But yeah, I really like that. So yeah, I got just a lot of basic stuff in terms of clothes. And then I went into Sephora because I wanted to get a sample of the new NARS uh, Velvet Matte Skin Tint. And I ended up buying something. Uh, I did get the sample, so I have this, and I think I'm going to do a um, first impression and wear test on it. Oh no, is it leaking? I don't know, I can't tell. But, uh, so I have that, so I will definitely do a first impression on that. I just didn't want to buy it because there's been such mixed reviews that I'm like, I need to just try it on myself. And then I finally purchased what I've been wanting to buy for so long now. And that is just the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. I got mine in the shade Vanilla because I want it to be good enough to cover my blemishes as well. I've just been not having the greatest luck with concealers recently. I'm kind of getting tired of my MAC Pro Longwear for whatever reason. Ah. So I just wanted to pick this one up because everyone loves it. So I figure you can't really go wrong with something that is so, so popular. So got that and this is like my first NARS purchase ever which is crazy to me but I'm really excited to use this um oh and I also got this uh it was a point perk so I got the Marc Jacobs fine liner um eyeliner and it is in the shade 42 blacker I just wanted to try it out because I'm also I've been looking for what? I'm very confused. Oh, there we go. I've been looking for a good liner, so I decided to 
try this out. Oh, is it not going to go back? That's not good. Oh no, please don't be getting smashed. Okay, thank God. Well, if you get this sample, do not scroll it up more than you need to because it won't go back down. <laughs> But I just thought I would try it, and the packaging is super cute. I go through eyeliners so slowly that honestly, this little sample will probably last me forever. And that's it for Sephora. I really didn't go crazy, but I did buy something that I've been wanting to buy for a long time. And lastly, I went to Walgreens, and I picked up three little things. I got the Wet n Wild because Wet n Wild was buy one get one 50% off. And I needed, I need a waterproof just liquid eyeliner because I have the Ico um, marker, but I just am not great with markers and um, it always turns into a disaster. disaster. This is actually eyeshadow if there's any left on my face, I don't even know. Um, so I wanted to just try Wet n Wild because it's cheap and it was on sale on top of that. And this is just the, it says new look, so I think it's the same liner a new look and uh, I just got it in waterproof black. Well that seems like a pretty sturdy brush actually. So good. And then for the second Wet n Wild item I got this new blush. It says new formula and it is Rose Champagne. It's just a really pretty kind of sparkly champagne, not sparkly champagne color. It's like a sparkly nude blush, and I don't really have blushes with sheens to them, at least not in this color. I have like a very light pink one and a peach one, so I just wanted to try this one out, and it's Wet n Wild, which I usually love, so yeah. And the very last thing that I got was this Rimmel Lasting Finish 25 Hour Comfort Serum Foundation. I got it in the lightest shade because I think that's right. But I've heard good things about this and I have been looking for a new drugstore foundation because I find that I want coverage more on a daily basis but I do not want to go through all of my good foundation because it's expensive and this was on sale for like five dollars today so I decided I would just pick it up that seemed like a good time to try it then I actually saved even five dollars more because I had points and so I paid like six dollars for all the makeup at Walgreens so good but yeah that is it for this haul sorry my voice is like being really weird right now um but yeah that's just what I got today and if you'd like to see the get ready with me on this look which looked better this morning <laughs> I will link that around somewhere so thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider subscribing to my channel. It would mean so much. And hopefully I'll see you in my next video. Bye.